Hello guys, today I want to answer a question from YouTube comment, this one. How to find the users with birthdays upcoming in next 7 days, for example, or 14 days, or a month, or whatever. And this is a more complicated task than you would think. That's why we will go kind of step by step, from simple to more complex approaches. So here we have a database table of users with birth date. This is a date field. This is what makes it complicated. We need to filter month and day, and we don't care that much about the year. So here I am in my Tinkerwell, and as I said, we will go step by step. The first step is today's birthday. A more simple example. And did you know that carbon has a function called is birthday? So if you have a user already, user object, one user, you can do something like this. We refresh, and we have true as a result because this is the birthday and I'm shooting this video on 13th of January. For that to work, you need to establish birth date as a carbon object, which you can do in the user model by providing birth date date in casts of eloquent model. Now, what if we want to have the list of users with birthday today? With that in mind, with this function in mind, if you have not many users in the database, you can just get all the users and filter them in a loop or in a collection. That would work if you don't... That would work for up to, I don't know, 1000 users, for example, or if you don't care that much about performance. This is kind of a slower... So, a slower approach, but... And this is the code. I've pasted it from my nose to save you time from live typing. You can do for each loop, all users. Again, this will download all the users from the database, so keep the performance in mind. And another approach is with a collection. Instead of doing if statement, you can do filter right away. And if you launch those, we have one email echoed here or as an array down below. But as I said, it's not ideal in terms of performance. So you make the PHP work for an operation which may be done in the database. And database is created for filtering, right? So we can use raw SQL queries to do the same on the database level. There we go, I've pasted the code. You can use where raw and then use MySQL functions of month and day. Or Laravel has a bit shorter syntax for the same thing, where month and where day, which would be equivalent to the same under the hood. If we launch these, the result should be the same. Array of one user is just filtered on the database level. So that would be okay for more records for tens of thousands of users, and it would download only the filtered data from the database. But all of these examples are for a simple task of birthday today. Birthday within seven days is a whole new level. Let me show you. This is an example query. And again, we're using MySQL raw function. So where raw, we have current date, and we compare that to the day of year of both birth date and current date. So this actually means is birth date within current date and current date plus seven days ahead. And that would work. So if we refresh that, we have the same user, which is today, and then another user. Here it is in the database with birthday of 19th of January, which is six days from now. So that filter is correct, you would think. But what if today we have 30th of December, for example. So if we replace that current date with 30th of December here, and if we launch that, it will not return any birthdays, although in the database we do have a birthday of 4th of January, which is within seven days. And of course, it's because day of the year is not number four, but instead is 360 something. And then that math doesn't work. So how to deal with that? Of course, there are at least a few options, but I've chosen probably the most readable one is to have if condition on the PHP level, on Laravel level, and check whether seven days ahead is in the same year or in the next year. And then we will launch different queries based on that condition. And this is the code. As I said, it's a combination of Laravel and MySQL row queries. So we have today with Laravel helper, convert that to date, and then we have another variable with added seven days. And by the way, don't forget that copy, otherwise it would change the original today value as well. And then we check in the PHP on Laravel level, if day of the year is less than until day of the year. If so, then we have the same condition of 
day of year like this which would work and in our case it would return the same two results as we had a few minutes ago with birthday of January 13th and 19th but otherwise if today is December 30th we have another condition of is day of the year of birth date between current date or 366 for leap year as well or if it's one until this until day and if we launch that we have the result of different emails which represents January the 4th and also January the 2nd for example if we change that to 31st of December and let's try to relaunch that we should have three results exactly so and even that is not all there's alternative to day of year instead of calculating the days of the year you may use another mysql function which is date format and then the code looks like this we have from day we have add days again and then we convert both to month and day and then we check those month and day whether they are in the same year so in sequence and then we can use date format between then they are converted as strings basically otherwise if we are at the end of the year then we're doing the same thing as in previous example having where raw or where raw checking for the end of the year until 31st of december and checking between january the first and until month day so yeah this is how many options we have for filtering birthdays and i'm sure in the comments you may have other options as well so please mention those and let's discuss maybe you have something else to share but for now i hope i answered the original question with some things mentioned along the way and you learned a thing or two about carbon laravel and Roma sql functions subscribe to the channel to get more videos like this one and see you guys in other videos